Hello friends, this is Jason here at Fission and Frog, and I want to talk about something today that's common with audio files. It's how to batch convert or take multiple MP3 files, convert them into WAV. Why would I need to do this? Well, uh, one big reason why is some DAWs only allow bringing in WAV files or AIFF files, and uh, MP3 files are compressed formats, so we have to convert them. Them, and we're going to use the audio world Swiss army knife <laughs> that is audacity so here I have audacity open what I'm going to do is I have a bunch of mp3s of waveforms here and these are all mp3s that are fairly small in size okay that you look at them they're really small we're going to convert them or uh, bring them back to wave files so we can drag and drop them into a daw and work with them now if you have a professional daw mp3 conversion is typically built in but it is something that if you don't know mp3 conversion just like audacity they use what's called a lame codec that is free it's not by audacity it's made by lame so uh you got to make sure that your professional DAW uses a, a paid version of a, a converter of some kind. So um, please know that that's why they don't have free versions, don't have uh, capabilities like that. Okay, so I drag and dropped all of them into Audacity. Here they are. There are seven of them, and feel free to play with them. But I want to convert them. Here we go. I'm just going to go to File. I'm going to go to Export. Now, I can do one at a time. That takes a while. So I would rather just do them all. And you can call this um, multiple conversion, batch conversion. This is actually a really um, a wonderful tool to use. Export multiple. Now, when you do this, you got to choose where you're putting them. Well, here's my, and here, I'll just move this. Here is my uh, MP3s I dropped in. I'm just going to put them right here in this folder. Okay. So I'll just say converted wave files, select folder. Now, this is the type. So we're looking at 16, but if you don't know, MP3 files are already 16 bit 44.1 K for the most part. Uh, so they're compressed. So what we're going to do is just convert them to wave files and 16 bit is fine. Okay. So that, uh, is there then as far as options go, we didn't choose any options. We have to worry about that. I don't want anything to change other than just the type of file mp3 to wave so i'm not going to change any of these things i'm not going to override anything i'm just going to hit export when i do metadata tags comes up this is a good thing by the way audacity has one of the best and robust i'm sorry some of the professional daws do not have features where you can add and remove tags at will and unfortunately um those paid programs don't have it, but a free software like Audacity does. So way to go. Um, as far as changing anything, I'm not going to. I'm just going to hit OK. Now, I should have seven of these in all. There's three, four, five, six, seven. Hit OK. All right. Now, whoop, it's done. <laughs> that was fast. So there it is. Whoop, there it is. And let me go back. OK. Now, if you look at these, there they are. OK. These are my... Wave files now. Okay. And if you, you know, go back and look at there's the MP3 files, go back to the wave files, there won't be a huge difference uh, in size. But if you do a like a properties here, it should say, whoop, there we go, um, wave file right there. Looks like it can open with groove music. You can open it with all kinds of stuff. You get the idea anyway. That's how you do MP3 to uh, wave. Uh, all right. So hopefully you liked that. If you did, let me know, like, and share.